No excuses, guys. We deliver. When we're given an opportunity to get an order and deliver, we deliver. But most importantly, we over-deliver and under-promise. Very, very important. Over-deliver, under-promise. But let's make sure that we deliver because there's certain people um, that really advocate for us and they open doors for us. And the moment we go in there and we don't deliver, they lose their voice in the boardroom. So it's important that we deliver and we make sure that when you get that opportunity, you over-deliver, right? And manage that customer relationship properly. The customer can't be the one chasing after you or me, right? But it's our job to be the ones who are ahead of the customer. So part of managing that relationship well with our customers is, you know, it's ensuring that we've communicated clearly with our suppliers, right? Number two, it's ensuring that we understand the timelines that it's going to take for us to deliver that on what we need to deliver on. Number two is consistently updating the customer on whatever delays, not just you know, updating them, but updating them in time. That shows shows a level of accountability, responsibility, and thoughtfulness. It's expensive to get a customer. The idea that we'll get another customer anyway, it's number one, expensive, and then over and above that, customers talk. So you don't want to ruin your reputation. Be a person of integrity. Do what you said you would do when you said you would do it and keep to your brand promise. But most importantly, let's respect customers and get things done and deliver, deliver, deliver.